What's happening, Panda Nation? Peter Von Panda here. Hey, I want to show you something I'm pretty excited about. You know that I've shown you some Black & Decker tools. Cordless drill here. Also, the cordless sweeper. Really like those. And this is the battery it comes with. It's 1.5 amp hour, 20 volt Black & Decker battery. <clears throat> Rechargeable. Comes with a little recharging slider right there. And one of the things that I wanted to do is get some additional batteries because, especially on the cordless blower, it's not a blower, it's a sweeper, technically. Um, it, it runs for like seven to 10 minutes, and then I can swap this next battery in, and it'll run for seven to 10 minutes. But then they take so long to charge up, so I really wanted a spare battery for that. So I was searching around, and I picked up a battery. And it's a, you can see here, it looks just like it. Now, here's the best part. Um, I was a little worried. I wanted to pick up another battery, but the Black & Decker battery was like almost 40 bucks for this 1.5 amp hour, 20 volt battery. But I found this from Vannon, uh, Vannon Batteries, I think the VannonBatteries.com, I think is the website, but then they also have them on Amazon. And it not only came with one battery, but it came with two batteries. In addition to that, they had some uh, additional capacity batteries here. Even though this is exactly the same size, and as far as I can tell, everything about it is just exactly the same. What you'll see here is that uh, 20 volts, but this is a 2.0 amp hour as opposed to the 1.5. So it has another third more power uh, capacity, so it, it, it runs longer. Uh, I was you know, a little worried about maybe buying a third party battery, but put it in, put both these in, charged them up, ran them in both my cordless drill, ran them in my uh, cordless blower, um, have been using them all week you know, as I'm doing spring cleaning, the whole nine yards, and man, they are great. Not only, did, uh, not only do they seem to hold the charge, but I get noticeable performance and um, duration improvements, especially on the cordless blower. The, the drill and the cordless drill that I have, which is great, you, it's really hard to kind of tell a duration because you're only using it and then you're taking a, a long break and then you know doing the next screw and stuff like that and then you're kind of waiting you know hours until you find the next job and so it just doesn't have like um, kind of a long duration you know all compacted together so it's a little hard to tell on that but it works great it fits great there's nothing about it that you would uh, put it in there and make it, uh, you know, it feel different. It slides in and locks in in place on both the charger and the cordless devices. And in fact, I can't even tell if there's a weight difference, although I'm assuming that this one has a larger lithium battery in it. Now, on the cordless blower is where it's really, really noticeable. So I kind of ran these, I did some uh, sweeping, and it works great with the 1.5 amp hour battery. But then as soon as I put these in, not only, you know, it, it still blows great. I mean, uh, I, you, know, you don't lose any power with the 20 volts. I mean, it, it seems to be <laughs> 20 volts or at least or, or better. Um, so right off the bat, it, it you know, feels great. There's, it doesn't feel like there's um, any difference, except how long the sucker runs. And so what I noticed is not only was I able to do sweeping uh, that would normally kill my original battery. So just kind of sweeping the patio uh, would would kill the, a normal battery. Not only did I sweep the patio, but then I went in the front and I swept like the front sidewalk, I swept part of the driveway, you know, and man, this thing just kept going. So it, it, it is a noticeable, noticeable difference. And then the funny thing is, I charged it up, but then I went back and I charged up one of the original batteries and I used that just to see, you know, I was like, okay, maybe this particular battery, my original battery is a little worn out. And so I had a backup battery, you know, that came with the cordless drill. And so I charged that one up and used that. And then I switched again to this 2.0 amp hour one. And again, just a noticeable runtime difference. Now, the best thing about these Vannon batteries is that you can kind of get them in some different capacities. They also had like a 4.0 amp hour, and I didn't want to step up to that because I wasn't even sure. I'm not an electrician, so I was like, oh, playing with too many numbers, does that screw everything up? Well, I'm really kind of tempted now to try that 4.0 amp hour one. You know, it, it, it drops down. It's kind of like an extended mag. There's kind of a, a, a larger um, lower portion. I'm sure it's going to be heavier, so you keep that in mind if you get fatigued either with the cordless drill or, or the blower. But just imagine that I'd have, you know, twice the the capacity of this high capacity but all you know like two and a half times the capacity of the the original one um pretty pretty impressive and like i said the best thing about this was 
um, the price. So to buy this original Black & Decker lower capacity battery was something like $40. To get this two pack of higher capacity batteries, I think I paid 33 something. So pretty amazing. I'll put a link to the battery in the description if I can find it. Um, but I'll also put a link to like their, their website as well as the Amazon store because it's not just Black & Decker. They have replacement batteries for a lot of different brands. And man, I am super, super stoked that I tried it out. So check it out. Um, I bought it, have used it, no issues, just a happy camper. Peter Von Panda out.